Hey, if you thought I wasn't about to fire Benzino ass up, you thought wrong. <laughs> Let's get petty. I'm going to let it speak for itself. You see it. You see it. I ain't going to say nothing. I ain't going to say nothing. I'm going to let it speak for itself. Why can't you understand that? You don't fucking look bad. I do. You can never look bad. Because you're the... Because, because see, in this world, you ain't doing nothing wrong. <laughs> it would be wrong if I did. Can't you get that through your head? You're not looking bad, Shauna. You're looking like a fucking chick. Hey, it's just a chick and she tried to fuck with a nigga. I'm looking wrong because what the fuck are you doing trying to fuck with a transgender? And I'm just now adapting to this type of world. But who I was before, I'm like alpha male. You know what I'm saying? I'm that nigga. Now, yes, I'm saying... This shit is all new to me, and I'm trying to be open-minded about it. But then I'm letting you start saying, wow, this is crazy, because she looks, I mean, the way they got you looking, the way you, it's just, you know what I mean? Like, so, so, and it's not like I've even, so, okay, well, let me go look at some other trans now. I haven't even looked at that. I haven't even done that. I love porn. I don't watch trans porn. I don't watch gay porn. But that's just me. You know what I'm saying? I'm old in my ways. I'm a 55 year old nigga. You know what I'm saying? So listen, like, daddy. So listen, daddy. It, it is what I'm, I'm going to try. I'm going to try not to be selfish. Okay, since you're saying I'm, I'm being selfish. Yeah, because you're not thinking about me and what I could be going through. That's not fair. I don't know, bro. Yeah, do y'all think, y'all remember when Benzino said that, you know, he ain't got beef with Eminem no more and. Eminem, one of the best rappers out here. Do you do y'all you, think he did that because he knew this shit was finna drop? It's and it's it's only an issue because it's Benzino, bro. Like I mean, he said some pretty. I mean, come motherfuckers can turn around and say say that I've said some homophobic shit. But like, I mean, I mean that's a good that's that's a good point. That's a good point. This is this this would be like me being caught in this situation, bro. I'm gonna get flamed. You know what I mean? Like I mean. So it's just, it's just, it's just who it is, bro. Like, and, and as much shit as this motherfucker's been talking, he's got, he's, he's been caught saying like pretty homophobic things in the past. Dog, come across this, like he would never find himself in this dilemma. Yeah, you know I mean, he would never find himself in a situation. But lo and behold, he out here, goddamn. Yeah, you know I mean, the the super heterosexual alpha big dog type of mentality, bro. But you never know. You never know what these motherfuckers is doing, bro. Like I don't give a damn. Look, look, y'all can think what y'all think, bro. If you are if you are not a hetero, or you're, hold on, I, mean, I gotta clean it up a little bit. Cause I'm not trying to damage my channel, bro. I gotta keep it a buck. I gotta, I gotta keep it all the way at stack, bro. You are you are not a you're not a thousand percent heterosexual. Hold on. Fuck, fuck, fuck. How, how do I say it? How do I say it? How do I say it? Um, yeah, they, you're you're not. You're not. You're not. You're, if you if you are if you consider yourself a heterosexual male, then if you fucking with if you are having intimate relationships with a transgender woman, so a individual that was born a male, that is transitioned to a woman. You're not entirely heterosexual, bro. I don't, I don't give a damn how y'all want to cut it and slice it. You know what I mean? Like, maybe maybe there's levels to heterosexuality. I'm sure there is. I'm sure there's a, probably a whole nother world out there that I'm not exposed to. You got like a thousand genders. I'm pretty sure there's a thousand sexualities too. Maybe there's levels to heterosexuality. Me, I mean, I'm on the goddamn... The Flintstone side of it, bro. You know what I mean? <laughs> the old school, bro. Like, they, I don't, I, I will never dibble and dabble, never consider dibble and dabbling in any of that. And then you got like motherfuckers that got them experiment shit with transgenders specifically. Like, if she presents as a woman and, and that's the dynamic of your relationship, but they're born a biological male, bro, you're not all, you're not, you're not all the way. You ain't, you ain't what you're saying you is, bro. You ain't what you're saying you is, man. I mean, however, however you want to slice it, dog. You got you got caught up. You got caught up. I mean, yeah, you got caught up big time, dog. Yeah, Zeno, 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 looking crazy, bro. Looking crazy, bro. And then um, you thought I was gonna drop this shit? Nah, fam. Nah, fam. Because he said too much. He said entirely too much reckless shit in the past to let this 
fucking shit slide, bro. Like he's the he's a super fucking troll and he's about to get trolled, bro. So let's let's see what he had to say about all this though. Let's see what he had to say about all this. Okay, before I get off the topic of Ray Benzino, video come out two weeks ago. You wilding out at the cops. Nah. In a red roof in. What the So it was five like, years ago. Like you trying to do better. It happened five years ago. That was five that was five years ago. Stop lying. That was five years ago. Are you serious? Five years ago. You you didn't see my Dominican baseball cut? I don't got that no more. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> I, 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 had the, I had the I had the Dominican uh uh uh, designated hitter cut <laughs> back then. <laughs> <laughs> um, yeah, man, that was probably like it's man, motherfuckers don't want to be held accountable, bro. Like they so, bro. If you fucked up, you fucked up. Regardless, of, regardless. Have y'all seen that video? Like he's bugging. He 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 must have like bipolar. He must be bipolar, bro, because he he'll fucking. Y'all y'all seen when the uh, cops arrested him because something shit with his some shit with his car or whatever, and he's being and he was saying all this racial shit, bro. Chinese food. He, he'll go, he'll flip shit on you, bro. You know what I mean? And then for you to be this old still acting like that, that's kind of crazy. So, like, I don't give a damn if it's five years ago, ten years ago, bro. You 55, so five years ago you was 50, and it's okay if you to act like that. Man, you got to hold these motherfuckers accountable, bro. Like, hey, you said it, you were record, you recorded saying it, bro. It is whatever. Unless you, went, unless you, like, went to therapy, and then it took you this long to fucking get where you at, bro. But... Whatever, whatever, dog. You, you, nah, fam. We've seen too many clubhouses at this point with this motherfucker talking crazy, bro. So anyway, I'm talking too much. My bad. Let's go. Five years ago, and um, my my child's mother had just took Zeno. He was one years old. Just moved him out of. We broke up. She just ran to California. Took my son out there. I ran out there trying to like figure it out, and um. Try to reconcile, reconcile with her. It didn't happen. I had to come back to Atlanta. I didn't have a place to stay. My money was low. Um, didn't have a car. Um, Cavario, who's a friend of mine over 20 years, worked at the Source, worked at Hip Hop Weekly. Um, used to uh, own write for Don Deaver and own it. One of my dear friends. I'm um, one of the smartest guys. Bro, get from to the, the streets point. I've ever met. And um, he picked me up because he lives in. He had lived in, uh, at the time, I guess he lived in South Carolina with his wife. Picked me up, and um, how can I put this? Because he, you know, I don't want to jeopardize Cavario in any way, but, you know, I came from Cali. I didn't have too much money. I had to do my thing, Prez. I had to get back Understood. in the streets. I mean, you don't even have to go, you don't even yeah. have to get no deeper into it. Let's leave it there. So he's out there slanging. The, 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 the disappointing thing Come is on, like, man. oh man, what's he doing? What's he doing in the hotel with another man? And I done been, we done slept. I remember on tour, we done slept in motels four deep, head to foot. People have this thing where everything has to be a gay topic. So I think that, you know, I didn't pay attention to it. But, you know, people try to, you know, say mean shit or whatever. But, um, you know, I, I, I found it not just funny, but just like ridiculous that we're at a stage now in life that if you're in a hotel room with a man that you have to be gay. You know what I'm saying? Um, I mean, we ain't saying you gay, bro, but you're something. <laughs> hey, regardless if, you was in the, regardless if you was in the fucking room with Buddy or not, dog, you know what I mean? Damn, I thought this was going to be, uh, damn, I, thought was gonna be, I thought he was addressing the fucking um, the trans shit, bro. Mm. Mm -mm -mm. Anyway, anyway, but Zeno going out sad, bro. So sad, dog. I don't even know if I want to post this, bro. Yeah, you know I mean, but anyway, man. Um, yeah, that's karma, dog. That's what that is. That's karma, bro. That's karma, dog. I mean, I didn't. Th no one gives a fuck. Only one, no one gives a fuck. Like, but it's karma, bro. Just, just for you. Just for you. you know what I mean, anyway. Uh, Night Nation. We out here grinding the go, going the ground all the time. Join the Night's Watch. You know what I mean? Fuck me over there. Exclusive shit. You know? Yeah. Peace.